Hey everybody, this is Trina or The Gaming Angel and I am here with a new packing video for the GDB Be Right Back. I got um, one on sale on Zappos.com uh, and this style is Flower Power and I want to show you how I packed it and what I like or don't like about the bag. So uh, first before I uh, put the focus on the bag and what I've packed in it, I want to showcase the back and the straps. Uh, the back has this nylon, which is really nice, and uh, the straps have them as well. The straps do feel really, really stiff when you first get it, but once they're on, they definitely feel a lot more comfortable and really mold to you. Uh, the bag itself is fairly big, but uh, it did not feel heavy at all, which is great, uh, especially for me as an overpacker, and you'll see kind of how much stuff I fit in here. Um, it was definitely lighter than the uh, Be Prepared, which is the bag that I recently got rid of because it's just too heavy on its own. And um, this bag also has some great rings here on the sides uh, for hooking up to a stroller. Um, it hooks up to a stroller clips really, really well. Um, so let me show you how I pack this bag. I'm going to put the camera on the bag. This gets the, there we go. Okay, so as you can see, uh, the bag has a front flop and two side bottle pockets. Um, I really love this side bottle pocket. The placement here with the full yellow flower on the side is really cool. If it's a Tommy Tippy bottle, we have on this side. On this side, we have um, a thermos water fits really well in there which is really nice and it keeps it insulated. Again, all jujube bags uh, are machine washable and uh, they have the 3M insulating on the side, which is really cool. Um, so we're just gonna go through these. Okay, so the front pocket here, um, I don't have anything in there right now. Uh, what I was doing with the other bags was putting a coin purse in here. I think this is probably a little too small for a coin purse, so I'll probably really just put a picture. Um, what I have been putting is like my keys. Um, in the front here uh, when I get out of the car. So that's what I've been doing. Then next up is the mommy pocket with zippers and has the gussets. So it kind of zippers and holds open. I've got my coach wallet and in the sunglasses case I do keep her sunglasses um, just because it's real easy to keep in there and easy to reach. I have a coin purse and another coin purse that I keep um, coupons in. Then in this little pocket, which is actually pretty big, I keep another, actually this is a small set piece, uh, where which I love. Again, I love small set pieces because of the gussets, and I keep all my loyalty cards and various cards in there that I don't need like on an everyday basis. Um, if you can see, on the bottom, it's got uh, mesh pockets, so I keep a uh, Kleenex, and I've got the small uh, med kit that I've gone through in um, some other videos about. I really like this. is an ouch pouch. It's got thermometer. It's got kind of everything I need just in case, and then I have some um, mommy things at the bottom just in case uh, I need extras. So that's the mommy pocket. This up. I really like this pocket here. It's enough room for I have a tissue holder and I also keep my phone in there. It's got this velvet, which is really nice and it's kind of a nice place to put things. Probably could fit a small camera, point and shoot, which is really cool. Before I go into the main part of the bag, I want to show you another cool pocket. It's this pocket kind of right here on the top and it's pretty deep actually, but doesn't go all the way. It probably goes right, right about here. And I keep her sunscreen wipes for Mom MD. I like these because she can be um, a little hard to keep in one place to put sunscreen on. So these are really fast. Um, I keep boogie wipes in here, uh, as well as hand sanitizing wipes. I keep usually a bunch of those in there. And then a neat um, as well, so it's easy to put this on her really fast. I also don't have it in here now, but as you can see, it's got plenty of room, and I keep uh, flat face wipes as well. So um, real easy to reach to clean. Um, I'm thinking about keeping all wipes in there, and so it would also be like the Clorox wipes to wipe down, you know, a table and stuff. But 
I uh, haven't done that yet. On the side is zipper for the change pad. It comes with a memory foam change pad. Haven't used it. Um, there's also room if you wanted to put probably an iPad or something in there as well. Let's go to the main part of the video, the bag. Um, the only thing with this bag is that it doesn't have gussets. So it zippers all the way open. There is a mom who is a seamstress who makes gussets for these and I'm thinking about getting them done so that it kind of holds it open uh, because when you're constantly reaching for stuff it's you've got to open this all the way which is the only flaw really. In here in this zipper pocket there's plenty of room. I just keep her toys and um, again these are kind of like flat toys, small things to keep her busy if we're somewhere um, and I keep her sun hat in here. Things I can quickly reach if I need to. Um, and again, there's plenty of space to put more stuff in. Then up here, I've got basically two quicks and a fuel cell. This is our diapering quick, which um, I've gone through in the past, but basically has, you know, diapers, wipes. Uh, we're actually running low on diapers. Uh, garbage bags, swim diapers, just things I need really quick. Hence the name Quick. <laughs> this is the Fairy Tella um, Quick, and I put spare clothes in here. We're running a little low because we were just using all the spare clothes, but there's usually shorts, pants, sweater, socks, um, basically two full outfits day or night that I keep in here just in case. Then we've got the fuel cell where I keep snacks, and um, basically the fuel cell fits my Zulily, um, it actually fit all five layers, four layers, but uh, I only have three in here now. Um, I've got this little snack pack that I got, it's called Nito's, and I put strawberries in them. Um, just kind of neat because it's machine washable and really easy to clean. Then I've got her toddler mumums, and we've got our Happy Tots. We carry two of these. She's actually already had one. And it all fits in here um, as well as her Auntie's Cheddar Bunnies. Uh, but all that fits in here really well. Yesterday I also fit um, a Horizon Milk to go. And I also usually fit an open if the toddler mumums or the snacks uh, in here so that doesn't crumbs don't get all over the bottom. Um, so that's the fuel cell. Then in here, as you can see, there's a smash pocket. Uh, I only have, so there's still plenty of room to put something else, but I have this boxlet in the Annie print uh, that a mom made, and it's got basically wipes, Clorox things. This is like her dining stuff. So there's spoon in here, there's um, more wipes, and uh, just basically anything for eating. But it's all in one place and easy to put in the mesh pocket. There's this um, kind of Velcro thing. I've seen people put a quick in there. It probably fits a medium set piece better than a large quick. Um, and maybe you could put uh, a thing of um, wipes there if you wanted to. So far I haven't put anything, but if you see, I can kind of quickly load this arrangement pretty well. I'm um, going to put the diapers the quick over here. And then this is the quick with the... So, and you can see there's still plenty of room. Um, I could put another quick maybe of just toys or something. Again, though, it is a little difficult to reach um, if I need to get something. What I've been doing is just kind of unzipping the side that the thing item might be on that I need. So if I need the diaper quick, I go on this side, pull this out, put it back in right there. It does keep... Um, pretty well its formation of the stuff I have in there so that's really nice um, but other than that yeah this is my Jujube BRB in uh, flower power and uh, all the hardware is still there with the really nice hardware and it's really good it gets dirty really easily but it, I took a wipe to it and got right off so uh, I am pretty much in love with the BRB I uh, can't see too many things bad about it other than the lack of gussets and um, look forward to probably getting more. <laughs> if you have any questions, let me know and uh, let me know what you think about a BRB. Thanks. Have a good day. Bye.